that you will always remember. It's the day that you became the world champion in your home area. How special was that moment for you? And talk to us about now coming to Las Vegas, defending your title on pay-per-view. Uh, you know, fighting basically in my backyard of Bedford, Texas. Uh, it was a beautiful moment for me. You know, I fought in, in front of my fans, which have been waiting for me to fight there for years and years. And finally, the opportunity came. All me set it up, which I'm really grateful for, PBC. And yeah, you know, I took advantage of that. Javier Sacón came in real cocky. Uh, you know, just as all my fighters think, I'm a, I'm a pretty boy and I don't know how to fight. But once, once I hit him with my power, that's when they realize, you know, what, what I made of. But yeah, it was, it, was, it was an amazing night for me. And I will never forget that moment. Your brother, Omar, has fought on the biggest stage as their mom. What has he told you? He fought here in July. What did he tell you? What did you learn about being around him when he fought here at the MGM Grand? It was the co-main event of Pacquiao Thurman back in July. What did you learn from him? And what has he told you as you are in the midst of fight weekend, just two days away from your world title defense? Uh, to, take, to take advantage of, of my youth, of this moment, uh, you know, just to take everything in and, and just, you know, experience this beautiful moment. Uh, and just give fans a great show, you know, it's an engineering grand title and premiere for the first time. You know, it's a, definitely a milestone of my career that I'm not going to forget. I've been dreaming of this moment since I was seven, and just like he did, you know, he came to this moment, and now it's my turn to relive it. Let's look at your opponent, Julio Seja, former world champion. Click and subscribe right here. And remember, it's fight night, bitches! <laughs>